will be able to starve millions of Americans and to control the rest. Would you explain what you were trying to say? Well, it, it, what I was trying to say is exactly what I said. There is weather control techniques. We have a complete package on that, which I did not bring, but I certainly will see to it that it is brought in for the record. Number one, the entire patents on the equipment. Number two, Senator Claiborne Pell's complete statement and story of his own that not only does it exist, but that we even utilize it as far back as the Vietnam War. You might want to touch base That's with right, Senator but I, Pell. I just want to repeat before so, I turn to So yes, yes so but we do have all that information. You're saying the government has created weather tampering techniques so that the, quote, new world order will be able to starve millions of Americans. Worldwide. Like, millions of Americans and to control the rest. Yes, sir, and that's my belief. As bizarre as that sounds, when if somebody had told me that that equipment even existed 10 years ago, I would have thought they were nuts, sir. And at this point in time, we have all the documents to prove it. And if you think that 85 tornadoes takes place in the middle of our growing area by simultaneous accident, I'm, I'm sorry. With the equipment that's already set up internationally, and as bizarre as that is, it is proven and documented. We will supply you with those documents. As bizarre as that is, I would say that weather wars, and this is uh, quoting actually Senator Claiborne Pell himself, that they are the greatest weapon ever created in the world, and that's the senator's own statement. So, yes, I have to do stand on that. Thank you, Mr. Fletcher. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Originally approached me in 1984 to find a use for the natural gas on the north slope of Alaska, which they could not sell. I chose a what's called a phased array antenna for the patents because it can be aimed. Picture holding your microwave oven in your hands with the door open. Then you can move it around and send those microwaves different directions. And that is the kind that HARP has built. If you beamed it for an hour and a half, that would equal the energy in a hydrogen bomb. The instant that we energized it, there was between a 4 and 4.5 on the Richter scale earthquake that occurred. We were so amazed about what seemed to be cause and effect. We get to an area that has a high propensity for earthquakes, we turn it on, and an earthquake occurs. A 7.8 magnitude earthquake shook Turkey and Syria in the early hours of Monday morning. It was so powerful that it was felt as far as Cyprus, Lebanon, and Israel. But this region is no stranger to earthquakes. So why was this one so devastating? This is one of the strongest earthquakes to hit Turkey in about a century. And it was followed by dozens of aftershocks, some almost as powerful as the initial quake. And then there's the question of how shallow this earthquake was at the epicenter, just 18 kilometers deep, causing severe shaking on the ground. 